What's going on everybody? Kenny Baum is in the building and it's Post Malone Day in WWE 2K24 and along with that, we got a new locker code. So, what kind of wrestlers can we unlock today, card wise? Usually they give me creative superstars, so hopefully we get some type of better result this time. But our locker code is M for money, I for N, T for the B for bank, briefcase b r i e f c a s e what do you got for us 2k locker code was redeemed successfully all right let's see what we get do we get wrestlers or do we get creative superstars again we got eight packs to open though faction wars ticket i'll take it I need another card to run through Faction Wars with because my guys be getting cooked. Two tickets. All right, so we got side play. Oh, no, we just opened up a wrestler card pack. Who do we got? So Singlet Supreme. Last time they gave me the creative wrestler, y'all. This time, can we get Chad Gable? I'm not, okay, you know what, Damian Priest? <sighs> Level 65, but yikes, that's actually pretty bad. He's going to get cooked. All right, let's go to the back end. Emerald Bobby Heenan. Super strength side plate. Okay, I mean, I'll take the points. All right. I like Damian Priest. I couldn't say that a few months ago, but now I like Damian Priest. I just wish that card rank was higher. All right, here we got a side plate. Barely use them, but we'll take it. Yo, I thought they gave me more wrestler packs. What's going on here? Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. What is this? Yeah, a side plate. So I guess they ain't told me no lies. Bianca Belair bonus. Oh, this is a locker code reward. Okay. It is a diamond Bianca Belair. You know what? I already got a Bianca Belair, and she's already pretty good, but I'll take another one. I'll take another one. She's like the only girl I actually use in this thing. Okay. So this one says Austin Theory. Why are they giving me spoilers? Is this really Austin? Ooh, that's a glittery card. It's a holographic glittery card. Ooh, all the special graphics. Come on, y'all got to cook then. So it is a spoiler. It's Austin Theory at 82. You know what? I can take an 82 Austin Theory. That's not bad. Not bad at all. We'll run. We'll run. We'll run with him. I'm going to put him in my lineup here right now. I like Austin Theory as well. Stop spoiling it, man. It, it's Bailey. Okay? It's Bailey. And I don't have a Bailey card yet, I don't believe. So I actually like this one. Now I don't have to use Bianca Belair in every match. I can use Bailey. I don't like to use Rhea Ripley. I don't like to use Charlotte Flair, but Bailey, she's a good one. I'll definitely take the Bailey. All right. Now, I believe this last pack is our DLC, Post Malone and Friends pack. So, this should be the DLC, guys. Martian Thrasher, they gave it to a, they gave him to they gave them a rating that was too low in my opinion, but I think we can make them work. 82 for Honky Tonk Man. I'm not going to use the Honky Tonk Man. Oh, he got an 80. Okay. Why did they say like 76? Oh, I guess that was just their in-game ratings. So the My Faction ratings actually are not bad at 80. So we got a good tag team we can use here. Shouts out to the Dudleys. But I really don't like Bubba Ray Dudley for a lot of reasons. So Martian Thrasher, I think, will replace those two. Who is this? Post? Nope, that is Sensational Sherry, and Sensational Sherry is who I don't care about. And last, what is Post Malone's My Faction rating? 80? If I gotta throw him in there sometime, I will, but <laughs> probably not. The man looks filthy, y'all. I'm sorry. Oh, is this another bonus? Oh, Jimmy, Jimmy Hart. Yeah, they did say we get the manager card. Ah, Jimmy Hart, I don't care about you either, buddy, but shouts out to you. All right, so we cleared our packs here. Now, I got to tell y'all about these live events because I hate them. These things are usually ridiculous. I cleared a few of them, but let's see. So I can do this one. Let's see. Charlotte scored a historic win. 
for Natalia November 20 with the SmackDown title to recreate the win. Okay, so my problem is they'll be like, run through this match in five minutes, but you got to get 90 My Faction points. You got to injure the body. You got to do two taunts and hit like three or four finishes. I'm like, bro. This is ridiculous. And the worst part is, I say three or four finishers or signatures because they reverse them. Like, I built my signature bar up all this time. I had to fight to get here through reversals. You reverse my signature, now I gotta do it again. In five minutes, cancel Christmas. Greg Miller is still awesome. As y'all see, we got the Greg Miller. We had to go ahead and get that one cleared. And this one, I think this might be one of those hard ones. One of the hottest young superstars. No, this is not. Is it? Yes, I think this is one of the hard ones. But you know what? Let's look at this one. What do we have to do? You do not have the, I do have a Charlotte card. Oh, I guess it has to be gold. I think mine is too beefed up. So let's try this one. One of the hottest young superstars WWE has arrived. I don't think so. She's been on SmackDown, y'all. She has not been cooking. A few backstage promos she's done, weak. All right, so we actually gotta switch this line up too. Or should we just use Mia Yim for this one? I guess we just use Mia Yim. Let's try it. What are the requirements? Yes, this is the one with the stupid requirements. I have to take Mia Yim at a level 59 and beat Blair Davenport when she's 80 something in five minutes, get 90 my faction points and get her body damaged. Hit a finisher and a signature. That's what we are not even going to try because I am not going to let this game stress me out. Let's go ahead and get our My Faction lineup set for the next time we make another run. I should take a look at the upcoming ones, but these things, y'all. Let's go ahead and manage these cards. Let's see what we're going to get in the lineup. So Joe Coffey, I tried to get him to take down Dominic Dijakovic, and it just was not happening. But you know what? With the Austin Creed, or Austin Creed, with the Austin Theory, I can get um, Bronson Reed up out of there. So we'll take him out. Who else are we going to take out? Uh, I was about to say, I know I didn't take the Undertaker out of the lineup. Let's see who else we put in here. Uh, do we put Roman? Kind of weak, but... The move sets fire. Definitely not gonna go post. I guess we gotta keep Bronson Reed in the lineup, man. He's our strongest card right now. Ugh. All right, so me, Meechin, you guys to get up out of here. We will replace Meechin with Bailey. And I don't think we need to replace anybody else. I would definitely take Becky Lynch out of here if we got somebody to replace her. Uh, I guess we don't. Where's that other Bianca Belair? Boom, Diamond Bianca Belair. We are going all Diamond Edition. So we got two Bianca Belairs in the lineup. Oh, that's actually a better Bianca. I didn't even know. I thought she was 92 as well. So let's get to it. We got a big win today, y'all. What do y'all think? Let me know in the comment section. But don't forget to drop a like on the video and smash the subscribe button if you haven't already.